Hi, I'm Rob from the Malt Miller and today we're talking kegs. These are our reconditioned kegs that are used but reconditioned kegs. Uh, we've been selling these for quite a while now. However, recently we have started selling them in a twin pack and also in a four pack. So basically, you know what the story is. The, the, the bigger the amount of kegs that you buy, the more money you can, the more money you can save. So we do these in both 19 litre and we've also got and this is relatively recent uh we've got used nine litre kegs as well but again we'll do those in a we'll do them singly in a twin pack and in a four pack in fact with the kegs actually we've even had um specialist packaging made for these so if you order two or you you order four they actually come in a uh, a purpose-made uh malt miller keg box so each one of these kegs has had um, new o-rings so it's new o-rings on both posts new o-rings on both dip tubes new o-rings on the lid and it also comes with a couple of spare o-rings for the posts now the kegs are european made kegs and um, they date back some of them are early 90s um, they were actually originally used for the soda industry so they used to uh, hold soda syrup long since defunct for that for that uh, use but now absolutely perfect for making beer so there's various different makes um, but they are the european makes so there's a b there's safer uh, there's cornelius and a couple of others as well and um, they come with stainless steel lids and all of the lids have a stainless steel prv so it's not a plastic prv it's a stainless steel prv one thing to note on these kegs is that the actual posts are different than some of our other kegs so they take specific posts so don't buy a spare post thinking that it's definitely going to fit on these on these kegs you need to contact us before you before you do that so the actual kegs themselves we split them into grade one and grade two obviously they've been used um, and they come into us with various different amounts of damage some of them are hardly damaged at all in fact the ones that are we're grading as our grade one so this is an example of a grade one keg um, we've got no major dents no major dents in the keg anywhere it's not had a it's not had a repair none of the welds are repaired the top and the bottom rubbers are in good condition uh, they've all been machine polished and you do get a bit of uh, that machine polishing residue when the kegs when you when you receive the kegs um, you get a bit of that on your hands that will wash off what they don't do is they don't leave horrible black marks once that polish residue has been been washed off they don't then carry on leaving leaving nasty black marks that's our grade one that's our grade one kegs just at this stage it's really important to, to let you know that we don't sell any kegs that are not fit for you so any of the kegs that we're selling are perfectly good for you to put your uh, beer in and they're good to go so they all come pressurized the posts work the prvs work um, and you can prove that by uh, when you receive the kegs you uh, pull the PRV and you can hear that they are actually arrived to you pressurized grade 2 kegs so let's just take a little look at these this keg looks as if it's really straight you really can't see too much in fact next to no dents on this keg whatsoever however what has happened to this keg is the sunlight gets to the rubbers and it the rubber starts to degrade slightly so when these kegs get wet you get a slight amount of a black coming off um, it's a black rubber residue it does get slightly better um, once you've once you've washed them a few times however they will keep on giving off a uh, a black a black residue another um, example of our grade two kegs would be and we're going to grade these uh, nine liters as well as the 19 so it's exactly the same exactly the same that's a dent big enough to say that that's a grade two keg it's not gonna um 
affect the use of this keg whatsoever. Um, still holds pressure, no issue. Um, but that would be that would be a grade two keg. Um, I want to show you an example of. This is a welded repair, and you can see it's been polished on the on the outside. If I open the lid, well, I'm going to get a shot of the actual inside. The welded repair on the inside, you can see quite clearly where it's been where it's been um, fixed, but there's nothing there that is going to damage your beer. I wouldn't use it as a fermenter, but then I'm not selling them as fermenters. I'm selling them so that you can put your ready fermented beer in here and serve successfully. Um, there's nothing wrong with using that keg exactly as it's intended and it will give you years of service. So that's the two grades. We've got grade one and we've got grade two. Both of them, no problem at all. They'll give you years and years of service. Um, grade two, there'll be a few more dents. You might get a welded repair. Um, they're, they're actually very rare, the welded repairs. There are a few in there that, that do that. Um, and just a few more dents in the, in the, in the grade two. Hopefully that gives you a really good idea of exactly what you're going to get when you purchase either a grade one or a grade two used reconditioned keg from the malt miller. Thanks for watching today. Please add any comments below and remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell for our latest content. You can also follow us on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. Cheers.